In families in Las Vegas are hoping for the best as Hurricane Lane inches closer to the islands. The storm system may also cause some travel delays. 8 News Now reporter Karen Castro is live at McCarran Airport with the latest for us. Karen? Well, Denise, so far so good today. No flight cancellations, but of course that can change with little to no notice. Meanwhile, I spoke to a local Hawaiian family who is also bracing for Hurricane Lane as it approaches the islands. The restaurant Two Scoops of Aloha is a little piece of Hawaii in Las Vegas for Steve Vergara. This is his happy place where he cooks up some of the island favorites. But lately his mind has been preoccupied. His daughter and sisters live in Oahu where Hurricane Lane is expected to cause flooding and mudslides. Uh, I've been calling them every day to see how everything is and they say they're, they're doing fine. Vergara says his family has stocked up on food and water and have boarded up their windows. But they're all prepared and well, um, um, they're very close to the family right now, staying close to each other. Vergara is also staying close to family. Oh, Steve, that's my uncle. Yeah, Uncle Steve. Des Batungbakal's dad is dodging the hurricane. He lives in Oahu but is visiting Las Vegas and staying through Tuesday. So I think everything will be over when he gets back for the hurricane. But Batumbakal's mom is riding out the storm. Usually I'm always worried when I hear some kind of like events going to happen, like a Mother Nature event. But when I call my mom, she's not, I'm never worried. Can you put a little bit of uh, all you Despite wanting to help their loved ones, there isn't much Batumbakal or Vegara can do but wait and hope for the best. Yeah, we just wish to make sure that everybody's fine and you know, hope to see them soon. Now, for now, all airports in Hawaii are expected to remain open. But remember, airlines can still delay or even cancel flights. So if you have any travel plans in the coming days to any islands in Hawaii, we have some helpful information for you on LasVegasNow.com. Reporting live, Karen Castro, 8 News Now.